They're still working even in the afterlife. They see her. Honey. What the f***? Howdy, folks. Oh, I'm back to you, me, and the movies. And what month is it, baby? What month is it? Now, what month is it? You said, "Diz it." What month is it? Um, remake month. That's right. Is that right? And guess what? Won the next remake poll. What? The House on Haunted Hill. Okay. From 1999. I don't know the original. It's a Vincent Price movie. So your 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 task for this movie is to figure out which character Vincent Price played in the original. Why are we watching a remake without watching the original? It's one of those that you don't really need to watch the original. But maybe okay. we'll get around to it someday. Great. Right? But I remember going to this in theaters, and it was... This is a good one. It's a scary one. Great. So, But there's a lot of familiar faces in this. Mm -hmm. This is about the time like, when horror, instead of horror being new actors trying to make a name for themselves, this was like when they hired known actors to mm -hmm. be in classic horror films remade. Can't wait. So, yeah. It's a lot of trend around the turn of the century. All right. Were well, you excited to go to a haunted house? Not really, but here we are. All right. Well, let's do it. But first, like, comment, subscribe. Come hang out with us for House on Haunted Hill. Yeah. And check out our Patreon link down below for early access to our videos while I'm coming here. Access to polls. So, pick watch next. Links down there. Check it out. Let's watch The House on Haunted Hill. Here we go. You're such a breathy talker. I don't know why. Put so much breathing while you talk. It's so weird. I think I peed a little. You just did? Yeah. I just pee a little. What year was this made? 1999. 99. Jeffrey Rush, he's the the pirate. What? Jeffrey Rush, is he the pirate? Yeah, that's Barboza. Tay Diggs, he's hot. Allie Larder, she's hot. Lots of hot people in this, huh? Lisa Loeb? Chris, Chris Kattan! He's hot! Alright, so hot. <laughs> I don't like that breathing. You freaked out yet? It's... I'm feeling a little disturbed, yeah. Definitely not haunted. Kind of feels like it should be a Vincent Price movie, doesn't it? <laughs> Is this a sanitarium, then? I love a freshly sharpened pencil. Yeah? We're cutting them open without anesthetic? That's cruel and unusual punishment. Uh oh, somebody got out. They all got out.
shouldn't have sharpened that many pencils. Guess not. A conflagration of biblical proportions incinerates nearly everything and everyone inside what was once the City of Angels' most celebrated medical facility, the Vatican Psychiatric Institute for the Criminally Insane. That's very celebrated. Mm. Would produce a sanitarium of slaughter supervised by a surgeon gone mad, Richard Benjamin Vanicut. Dr. Richard Benjamin Vanicut. <laughs> Restored almost to its original state, but it has yet to be inhabited because some say the spirits of Vanicut and his victims still live within the walls of the house on Haunted Hill. Well, yes, on Haunted Hill. Is that just the name of the hill, or did they call it that after the house became haunted on the hill? Don't know. I think that's the Incredible Hulk roller coaster. I've been on that. Hmm. Yeah, well, that is so totally fucking fascinating, but I've got to get back to you. They're trying to shoot me here. Barbosa. He's got both his legs back. We were talking about your roller coaster that is, quote, unlike any that has ever come before it. Absolutely. No cheap thrills. Genuine journey to the brink of madness. Sorry, but it just looks like a generic roller coaster to me. Would he be Vincent Price? Does he look like Vincent Price? Yeah. A little mustache. Oh, well, geez, you can do that it. task real quick. Mm hmm. The mustache, keep it away. Growing pains. New Steel's got to bend and stretch a little before finally settling in. Don't worry. In the 15 year history of Price Amusements, we've yet to lose a single customer. Price Amusements? Yes, yeah, Stephen Price. Do something! I want! This isn't supposed to be happening! Oh, Jesus! Oh God! <laughs> if you jump right as you hit the ground, you'll be fine. Totally. <laughs> if they were actually dropping, they wouldn't. They would be airborne in there. Yeah. Yeah. From here on, it gets gotcha. really scary. Oh Jesus! <laughs> Yep, this is the Hulk. It starts from the bottom. It launches you, goes like zero to sixty in like two seconds. I honestly think I might be too chicken to be riding roller coasters anymore. Too worried about dying on a roller coaster. I don't think you're supposed to have two roller coasters going at the same time like that. It's a fake. A decoy car in front that looks like it crashes. How does that work? Where does it go when it flies off the rails? Uh, that doesn't make sense. I have to ask Blabs on that one. She sends her roller coasters into a giant pit of water. Sixteen people have died in the rain, in the water, and they also burst into flames. No bodies. No cleanup. No paperwork. It's good. I think we're good. Good song. Well, that's terrifying. We'll give you a million dollars if you survive the night. Why would you go to that party? You wouldn't do it? No way. Not even for a million dollars? Definitely not for a million dollars. Stakes are too high. <laughs> I think I did. Uh, hi, uh, hi, I'm sorry. I'm a Pritchard. Watson Pritchard. I own the house. 
Okay, so let's let's move if we could. So, uh, is this dump really haunted? Uh, it, yeah, it's, uh, yeah, yeah, it's, it's pretty scary. Uh, <laughs> okay, uh, let's uh, go up further. Why don't they just clear out the driveway? Also, what's with the strobe light? It's not like it's a friggin' lighthouse. Might be. It's like the faces that were looking down on them when they... Did the operation. <laughs> it's touching. Are you gonna come in? No, I'm good. <laughs> if I can just get something bizarre enough on tape, I think I can parlay it into getting myself some sort of a wackiest home videos gig. What you got your own TV show? Had, sweetie. Past tense. Currently looking for the right angle to either earn or fuck my way back in. Honesty. I wouldn't worry. I'm sure by the end of the night we'll be hacked up into little pieces by something or... Uh, some... Is this a clue sort of situation? Could be. Hmm. Jean Grey? Mm-hmm. Who the fuck are all of you? Oh. Happy birthday. Get off of me, you pervert. Congratulations. I don't think Evelyn said those words to anything with testicles. Ever. <laughs> sure is a funky old house, ain't it? Let's have a word, sugar puss. Oh, I think we ought to have several. They seem like they're happily married. Totally. Those blockbuster video things are digitally placed. Right? It looks like it. Digital product placement? After the fact. It's like, who wants to buy this ad, ad space? space. Yeah. I don't think it worked out for blockbuster. Think I invite that bunch of social rejects? Sure, no, it wasn't me. And if you say it wasn't you, then who the hell did Evelyn? Ghosts. Ooh, spooky. You know, if you really love me. Find a way to drop dead in the next three seconds. Finding ways for me to die is really your deal, isn't it, Evelyn? Let's not forget the OJ knife with the not quite retractable blade. <laughs> I'm gonna run scalding water on the place you just touched me. And then I'm calling a cab. Surprised it lasted this long. How do I know? Okay. <laughs> Don't talk yeah, to me. Right. Uh, it was that Nazi bondage episode. Chris Catan's grandpa. Was the crazy surgeon, you think? I think he just built the place. As in construction. Because his dad re renovated it, right? Mm. It's a family business of constructors. You die, you lose. Your check gets divvied up by those still amongst the living. Uh, uh, but look at the bright side. If there's only one of you still upright at dawn, you'll be leaving here with $5 million in your pocket. <laughs> I've never heard of any of you. <laughs> Great, then why are we here? God damn it! You give me my goddamn check right now, because I want it. So you give it. Now! Here you go. I think you're going to miss the bash of a lifetime. My loss. Even if I give you a million as well. I wouldn't have to do with it all. Thank you. <laughs> Before the door's close. It's gonna miss it. He doesn't seem happy to be there. Who activated it? Fucking damn it. You still have to see those freaking strobe lights that come from nowhere. Is this your idea of a joke? 
This is your house. You know that you can't get out. Fucking idiot. What happened? Lockdown. What is that? It's a machine from the old asylum. It seals everything shut. That's how they burned to death in 31. Dr. Vanek threw the switch. Well, let's get back to the other room and I'll take care of your hands. The only ones that survived were five of the sadists on Vanek's staff. Who are the five people that survived? The sadists? Five? Is that what he said? They're not all heirs of or descendants of the five that survived. Think so? Yeah, that would be my guess. All right, Pritchett, this lockdown thing, there's got to be like a main control room in this place, right? In the basement, but you're not going to want to go down. No, you don't want to go down hey, there. Hey, no, we will both go down there and try to put a reverse on this thing. Don't you think now's the time to break out your party favors? What are you talking about? Same exact setup you used back in 94 for the son of Sam Hunt. Bunch of clue weapons. Definitely. Candlestick, ropes. Lead pipe. Or just guns. Everyone gets a piece. So how's a girl to know if these things are loaded? Only one way I can think of. <laughs> oh. I think I'll let the virgin have first crack. I don't want a goddamn gun. I'll take it. Let's just go. I think guns will help against ghosts, right? No. Little shovel horrors. I knew I should have kept my ass at home. Think those things are still alive? Maybe. Like Indiana Jones, Temple of Doom. At least give me a couple of seconds notice before you pull a stunt like that. The lockdown thing? You know. It wasn't me. What do you mean? I mean, I, I was just sitting here and it happened. I had nothing to do with it. Then who did? No idea. Maybe it was just the thing's time to finally fall apart. Somehow. I don't know how. She did it. He doesn't think the place is haunted. You should really open up this place to the public, Pritchett. Spa for people without enough stress in their lives. There haven't been any changes to this part of the house since, I don't know, 1931. Is that a fact? Oh, Jesus. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> you alright? Yep. Well, that's promising. This place reminds me of the hospital we visited. Yeah? Is that what it was like in the basement? Just like this. What is this? This is the uh, saturation chamber. It's supposed to bombard them with images and weird noises. Just scare them back to normal. Did it work? <laughs> I don't know. Did it work? Nope, they just disappeared. Strength in numbers. Can you get me up? Yeah. What's up? Hey, pal. That wasn't code. He's for... just helping. What? You do the same thing when I help you up places. <laughs> this whole place can't be wired to just one circuit. You're just playing around with wires? She'd get shocked to shit if she actually did that. <laughs> maybe she was grounded. Yeah, I guess. Maybe. I've never in my life met an executive who could tie their shoes, much less rewire an entire building. Uh, there's always exceptions. No. Come on, what's the truth? The, the truth is, if we keep taking rights, we're going to have to end up where we started. Are you just going circles? So she's Vanekit's granddaughter? Know anyone that could have seen through me like that. She's taking lefts. 
Real name is Sarah, and I'm a sister. Was, anyway. He's not with you, dude. Eddie? Yeah, next time hold hands or something, right? Oh god, Eddie. Eddie? Oh god. He's not okay. You know, for a second I actually thought that you were a decent guy. What is your problem? He's been possessed by a demon. Basement demon. I don't like that sound. What the fuck was that? Oh no, don't go in there. What are you doing? What is that? Blood. What the hell are you doing? What the fuck? What's in there? Where the hell did you go, bud? Jeez. Where is he? Where's Price? What happened to you? Are you all right? No, I'm so fucking far from all right, it's not even funny. Someone or something just tried to drown me in a tank of blood the size of a Buick. Hmm, not that big. Like a Volkswagen bug. Look at this, huh? What is this? That? What just happened to you there? That's nothing. You've just been playing around with the ghosts. Wait till somebody lets out the darkness in this place. That's a whole, that's a whole new bunch of crazy shit. That's... Either we spend the night and collect our money, or we try to find a way out of here. Either way, I think we should all stick together. I guess somebody better go find the old game show hostess. Where is she? Sort of like by yourself? Just hook up an N64 and play some Mario Kart. Yeah. That'll kill the time. Yeah. <laughs> No problem. I know Allie Larder had like the whole whipped cream bikini thing, but honestly, she in Billy Madison, way hotter, right? I don't even know her name. Wasn't it Rebecca something? I don't know. No, Bridget. Oh, Bridget. Bridget Wilson. Yeah, yep. Oh, interesting. They're still working even in the afterlife. They see her. Still doing their fucked up experiments. Honey, what the fuck? <gasps> oh, 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 God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. <laughs> Are you okay? I hate you. <laughs> the ghosts are kind of jittery. I hate that. God, I'd love to get laid before I died. How you doing tonight? <laughs> yeah, I'm all right. <laughs> 
she all right? I don't know. It's probably not her blood, right? Oh, it's not all right. This. Not all right. Shit, she's gotta be somewhere. She, she, she couldn't have just disappeared in the thin air. Not air. Into the house. Great. How's that work? Pritchett. Then what? I'm talking to you. Oh, oh, help yourself. Easy. 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 Easy.
Who are these naked ladies? Are you supposed to be like on like LSD when you watch this or something? Possibly. Class of 1931. That's a cherry looking bunch. Better living through electricity. I think. Jensen? Everyone that was invited is related to one of the staff that was here when the place burned. Five that didn't die. Booga booga. Christ didn't make the list. The house did. Too bad she isn't Jensen. Her yeah. boss is. So she's going to be the final girl. They have no reason to kill her. She's the wrong person. Yeah. House didn't think about that before I jumped on the internet. This house is pissed. It has no morals. Because it's a fucking house! Sane. Right, calm down. All right, I'm sorry. Sorry about that. And it wants to finish what it didn't in 1931. Correct. How come Blackmore's name's not on here? He is a descendant of Vanicut. Uh, the late Mrs. Stephen Price. Or just a psychopath that wants to live out some sort of twisted fantasy. Not cool, dude. Cool. <laughs> what do you think you're doing, mister? Ooh, her lover. What's Stephen's status? Well, he's still alive, but it's, it's just a question of moments. What we need... There's another body. And Steven, you would hear me out. She wasn't a big fan? I guess their affair's over. Bitches be crazy. You're telling me. <laughs> this here. Well, it's gonna have to do. Yeah. What are they gonna do with that pole? Price's brain's got to be mushed by now. Oh, shit. Did she chop off his head? Well, that's all messed up. Who's going to sign the checks if he dies? Oh, shit! Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa. Grab her, grab her. Damn. It's empty. <laughs> it's empty. And now she's a murderer. <laughs> Almost done. Just get upstairs. All right, easy. Don't look, don't look. Where does wife go? I don't know. Hiding behind that fish tank. Do you have a vest on? I have always, always loved your money. I'm 
50 goddamn price. <laughs> I'm gonna murder you, Evelyn, with the greatest plan. Witnesses. Well, she's already dead to everybody else. Happy birthday, baby. Oh no. Now the demons are really gonna escape. Evelyn. Evelyn. Get up. Stephen? Are you doing this? No. They're so fucked up. <laughs> And now they both believe the house is really haunted. It's like an ink blot. Oh, she's melting. Those are weird graphics. Killed her real quick. Oh, hey, there she is. Oh, shit. It's escaping. Thought this place was haunted before. What do you see? A devil. They need to use that fork that was thinner and stick the end of that fork in that pipe and then use the pipe to leverage the fork, right? Use your brain. Oh, that ink blot is pissed. Run! Run where? She's like, I just shot you. How are you alive? They're never going to be able to sell this place. Move! <laughs> Run! Likes to play with its food. Apparently. This movie's weird. There's light. There's light! Stay here, I'm gonna go. Let's see if we can get out this way. Where'd Price go? Go! Wow. He sacrificed himself. one of the descendants. He has to be sacrificed. I was adopted. Oh, he was adopted. Pritchard go goes helping. I was adopted. And the black guy lived. Yeah. Upset the trope. Oh, well, they still have to get off this. Is it their check? What is this? Is it all five million dollars? Totally. 
Oh, they're cashier's checks, too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Hold on tight so they don't blow away. Yeah. <laughs> Gotta get down. Uh, how do they get down? Okay, one more thing. How do we get down from here? Yeah. Anybody bring a cell phone? Before cell phones happened. I don't like that creeping. You don't want to listen to that remix? No. The Haunted Remix featuring Marilyn Manson. Marilyn Manson? That was his cover of that. Oh. Okay. Wasn't the original Sweet Dreams. I am aware. I didn't know it was Marilyn Manson, though. Yeah. All right. Well. I guess they both weren't of the bloodline that. Apparently not. In that, or we're supposed to perish in the house. Fucking house made a mistake. It's got to open its doors again for the last two. Yep. All right. What do you think of the house on Haunted Hill? It was weird. Yeah. It felt very Lovecraftian. Okay. I think. Lovecraftian to you? With the psychological stuff and the weird doctor creatures. Yeah. <gasps> oh, oh god. You know, like that shit. Jittery stuff. Terrifying. Yeah. The split up frame rate. Yeah, I hate that. Or the drop frames on them. Both. It was both like sped up and drop frames, right? At the same time, both creepy. Yeah. It's weird. It's the creepy part of this movie. I hadn't seen this in twenty five years. Bummer. Since, since it came out. Sure, you didn't miss I it. it huh? being, I remembered it being better. Yeah, the special effects there at the yeah, end. I haven't really aged. I do like the well. concept of it though. How it, it was an ink blot. Like the cycle. Yeah, I mean that makes plot, that's clever, I guess, but I totally forgot that's what the house monster looked like. Yeah. But it was kinda like, oh we got digital effects now, let's use them. It yeah. Reminded me of some other movies that we've watched recently. Another house that kind of like consumed its people. Can't remember what it was called, so One of the T V shows? No, it was a movie. It's like the big machine. It opened portals. Well, oh, thirteen ghosts. No, well, that maybe a little bit, but um, an older one that had a guy that used a big machine, opened a portal in the attic. Oh, from beyond. Maybe that's what it's called. And that was the Lovecraftian movie from beyond. They had like space worms and stuff coming through the portal. Yeah. Yep. That's what it reminded you of. That one plus 13 ghosts, yeah, kind of like a combo yeah. of both of those. Okay. Is that weird? And then a little bit of, like, Hellraiser in there. Yeah. Weird. Well, who was your favorite member of the, the party? Pritchett. Chris Kattan? Yeah. Yeah. And he was still good. Mm-hmm. Because he was innocent. He saved him. Yep. Helped. Helped him get out. Helped Eddie get out. It was clutch there at the end. Yeah. I always remember that part. I was like, that's kind of corny, but kind of funny because it's Chris Kattan. Yeah. Came on a, a lover. Mm -hmm. Helping him out. So. Now, I've actually never seen the original House on Haunted Hill with Vincent Price to compare it to. I know the concept's the same as they go to a haunted house and whoever lives through the night gets a million dollars. And I think it's the same concept of if it's supposed to be fake, but it ends up being real mm -hmm. kind of thing. So, but interesting. Yeah, did like how uh, Jeffrey Rush was channeling Vincent Price as much as he could with yeah, the, the, mustache the mustache and mm -hmm. the way he dressed. Yep, the outfit. That's a homage there. It was so, callback. Love it. Yeah. Well, what do you guys think? Yeah. How do you feel about this one? What are your thoughts on House on Haunted Hill? Is it as scary as you remember it? Yeah. It had like that one good jump. That's about it. With. What's your name? Getting the mm -hmm. TV star. Getting Mara. Jumped by the monster. It's about the only one. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, that's about it. Tell us what you think. Thanks for hanging out. Come back next week for something else. Yeah. What's next? No idea. You never know. I never know. Check out our Patreon link down below for early access to our videos. Long time, early access to polls. Helps you pick watch next. Links down there. Check it out. Until next time, have a good one. Bye.